So today we'll be learning about cells and basically what's inside of them and what they do. There are two different types of cells, eukaryotic cells and prokaryotic cells. Eukaryotic cells are cells inside us such as uh, animal cells and plant cells. Prokaryotic cells are single-celled organisms that can survive only like by themselves, which are bacteria. In the prokaryotic group, only bacteria are in that group, and they do not have a membrane, and but do have cell membranes, cell walls, DNA, and ribosomes inside them. There are two types of eukaryotic cells, plant cells and animal cells. Both are very complex, but are also similar and different. What are things inside the cell called? They're called organelles, which are specialized structures in cells that perform important cellular functions, which are basically organs inside of us. They act as organs for the cell. The cell membrane provides a boundary for the cell and controls what comes in and out of the cell. So it acts, it's basically like our skin for the cell, which like protects us and stops bacteria from going inside. The cytoplasm. Its function is to protect and support the organelles inside the cell, and it aids in transportation within the cell. The nucleus, found in eukaryotic cells only. Function is that it controls most of the cell processes. The endoplasmic reticulum. Transportation route of the cell. Materials travel through it, such as proteins. There are two types of endoplasmic reticulum, rough and smooth. Ribosomes, they form proteins and can be found in rough endoplasmic reticulum. Golgi apparatus, there are proteins from the endoplasmic reticulum and labels and packages the proteins and gives them directions to follow. Mitochondria, which is also known as the powerhouse of the cell. It's found in many places of the cell and makes energy or ATP from food and oxygen for the cell. Lysomes contain enzymes that can break down nutrients. Also, they break down dead organelles. Vacuoles store materials such as water, salt, proteins, and carbs. So it's like a bookshelf where it stores many books and other items. Centrioles, involved in cell division found only in animal cells. Chloroplasts uh, use energy from sunlight to make energy rich food molecules, a process known as photosynthesis, and it is found only in plants. Cell wall, Function provides support and protection for the cell and allows materials in and out of the cell. Cell walls are only found in plant cells and for animal cells they have the cell membrane. These are the two different shapes of the plant and animal cell. As you can see on the plant cell they have this thick outer wall which is the cell wall and on the animal cell they have a thinner cell membrane. And that's all for today's lesson on cells and the insides of cells.